Justin, thanks. Call it a royal face-off. One queen trapped in a castle, another trapped on her throne. What happens next? You'll have to see TheatreWorks' latest production, Mary Stewart, to find out. Lead actress Claire Warden is here to tell us more. Good morning. Good morning. This sounds like such a fabulous play, and I guess it's based on a story written like back in 1800 and portrays the last days of the Queen of Scots, correct? Yeah, that's right. It's Frederick Schiller, a fabulous German playwright, wrote it in the 1800s. Um, and this is a new, reasonably new adaptation and translation by uh, Peter Oswald, which is, uh, was the one used on Broadway and on the West End. So it has a lot of historical uh, value, um, and it's really a true, gripping drama. Kind of set up set it up for us a little bit. Absolutely. It's, it's the kind of story that it, it, you couldn't really make it up. You know, it's, it's, it's so strange right, that right, it's right. that. That's true. Um, Mary Queen of Scots um, and Queen Elizabeth of England, two very powerful women. Um, Mary, Queen of Scots, after uh, uh, many mistakes and a rather torrid past, uh, escapes, is, is hounded out of Scotland, comes to England for refuge and asylum, seeking from Queen Elizabeth. And um, fearing her, that her assassination attempts and fearing Elizabeth fearing Mary wants the throne of England, she locks her up to decide what to do with her. Actually, historically, she was in prison for 18 years before they decided what to do with huh. her. This play takes the last four days of her life um, whilst Elizabeth is being pressured by many of the men in, the, in her court and her council to behead um, Mary to kind of nix the threat that they say she, she is posing and it's a, it's, a, it's a real question of the heart of justice and of the morals whether to kill a queen and in fact her relative because yeah. they were cousins. Yeah, it sounds just, it's just like an incredible production. I know the cast comes from everywhere, correct? Yes. And, and you are not local. No, I'm not. Yeah, no, obviously. Um, <laughs> originally from England, yes. I now live in New York City okay. um, and at there we have two other actors from New York City. Uh, we have a great actor down from Denver, um, and we also have some local um, Colorado Springs actors as well. So it's been a wonderful mix um, of, of new people thrown together, different experience, um, and lots of different views kind of all coming together to make this great show. Some of the costumes look fantastic, they too. Have, yes. Are they comfortable, some of those? Well, <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I mean, the, it's, it's, it's a fabulous concept in that the women, the three women in the play, are, are dressed in period dress, right. and the men are contemporary. Hmm. Um, um, you know, we get corsets. Um, I'm used to wearing corsets. I do a lot of corset work anyway. Um, you know, they, they take getting used to, um, but, you know, we can we can adjust them to, to what we need for our acting. And how have been the audiences so far? Great. Yeah. We've had some fabulous audiences. Yes, big houses, very responsive. Um, it's a real high-octane um, an intellectual and emotional play all at once, so it's it's a, a lot to really get your teeth yeah. into. Just I was like it sucks along. you in, right? It does absolutely, and it and it picks you up and drags you like a roller coaster along for the whole show until the end. And everyone has been um, has been wonderfully excited by the by the story, by the arguments, mm -hmm. by the, the and the learning fights. something about history as well, well at the same hope. time. Yeah, I mean, you know, Schiller takes a few liberties with history. Um, the big. Um, like ultimate um, scene in the middle of the play is a meeting of the two queens, and they actually never met in real life. Okay, um, okay. So it's an adaptation, it, obviously. It is, it is. Let's put up some information on the screen, because if you would like to check it out, you definitely need to do so if this hasn't intrigued you enough. It's <laughs> going to be at the Dusty Lou Bon Vivant Theatre through May 6th, Wednesday through Sunday. Tickets range from $15 to $30. You can call the number on your screen, 255-3232, to get tickets, or you can log on to the website, which is theaterworkscs.org, and and I understand they're giving a special promotion right now for Fox 21. You can, if you go online, you can um, enter the code Fox 21 and actually get a discount on a Wednesday night performance. So be sure and take advantage of that. Good luck with the show. Nice Thank to you. meet you. You too. Thank you for having me. And we'll be right back. Wait.